Hey guys, um, good evening. Thank you so much for being here tonight. Um, we thought about canceling this week's events with what is going on in the world right now, but we realized that maybe tonight was a good time to share something different, share a little bit differently, and um, really come here and talk from the heart because in uncertain times, it is, um, it's imperative that we kind of band together and that we share, um, we share some stories of hope. So most weeks that we have run this event, we really try to open up with um, a bang. We try to open up with um, a trio of products that we love. And you know, we're gonna talk about it super briefly tonight because so many people are really, really worrying about their immunity right now. And um, I am too. And I'm gonna be honest, when some information came out this week that um, some of the ingredients in one of our probiotics, two of the strains are specifically being used to treat this virus in China with success. And that some of the people that they're testing that are finding out that um, their gut bacteria is depleted in these two strains, and um, it's actually kind of fascinating, but um, I've never been more sure that we are onto something that can really, really help. So we talk about the triplex every week. If you wanna have a look at the triplex videos that are in there, search in the search bar, you can watch. But I really wanna talk quickly about immunity today um, and kind of a story of hope of my own. So. If you were to be thinking about what you wanted to do to look after yourself right now, um, you probably do wanna try the Triplex. You probably wanna add, which includes our Plexus Slim. Um, sorry, I've got Derek here tonight too. He's gonna to share with me Plexus Slim. Then we've got our ProBio CA. This is like amazing. This is the one that's gonna put those those bacteria back into your gut and your BioCleanse. Um, amazing, amazing magnesium product. Um, and then, you know, if you really wanna start looking at your immunity too, X Factor Plus multivitamin, you can search any of these in this event and get lots of information on them. Just search in the search bar at the top and ease. It's an anti-inflammatory as well, but not like ibuprofen. Um, so those would be the products that we would recommend that you get started with um, if you wanted to really start tackling your immunity. But what I really wanted to go back to was three years ago for myself, okay? This is a night about talking. Um, hey guys, thanks for jumping on. Um, talking about hope and, and health and happiness. And um, when I go back three years ago, I never thought I'd be sitting here. Um, I wouldn't have thought that a virus was gonna be what took me out. I would have thought it was probably gonna be myself. So um, when I go back to that place and think about where not looking after my insides had brought me. Um, I was depressed, I was anxious, I was um, in such a dark place that I would go back to bed even when a day was normal. You know, like it was a regular business day for me. I'm a personal trainer um, and I would go back to bed after I dropped my kids off at work. I would cancel clients because I couldn't handle it. I couldn't cope with life um, and I didn't want to talk to anybody. I didn't go anywhere. I didn't, um, you know, I would do the things that I had to do with my kids and that was it. And lots of people didn't know because I came across as being normal. I used all my energy when I was out to look like I was functioning properly. Um, and then when I started using three of those products at Triplex um, consistently, all those things started to change for me. And I will tell you right now, during what's going on in the world right now, I would, I would be in bed right now if I had made it this long. And the fact that I'm here and I just want to help people feel better during this period about themselves, about life, about where we're going, about all of those things. Like I'm getting goosebumps right now and I'm not gonna, I'm glad I'm wearing a sweatshirt because you'd see something else poking <laughs> out right now. Um, but it, sorry guys, sorry, my humor is offside. So um, I just wanna help people through this because I really shouldn't be here being able to experience what we're experiencing this right now. And I know it's scary and I know that the unknown is crazy 
But there's also something else attached to this that if you're worried about your finances, I'm gonna tell you there's a gift in here with that too. And I don't wanna oversell anybody. I don't wanna to talk to anybody in a way that they think that I'm like, you know, trying to sell something. I mean, of course I'm involved in a business that is involved with sales, but if you're worried about a paycheck, you may be sitting here watching this and realize that there is a way to bridge that gap right now. And I'm gonna tell you another story, my personal story. I could share so many other people's stories, but I'm gonna share mine. And it's embarrassing and it makes me feel uncomfortable sometimes, but I was behind on my property taxes three years ago, okay? Like to the point where I was a little scared. And I was a single mom, we still were sharing two homes um, and we had two houses, to, two households to run. We had five kids. I was had a successful business, but you know, I was canceling clients too because I just couldn't cope. So I wasn't earning as much as I should have been. Um, and I put my kids in the most expensive sports that you could ever imagine. And I did everything to do that. And I got behind on some things. Okay. So I needed to make some money. I had no interest in this business whatsoever. You can ask anybody when I first started, I refused to even put my name on a network marketing company. I'm no word of a lie. I made Derek's name go on. I wanted nothing to do with it. So, um, when I started sleeping and my mood elevated, people noticed. And we started building an accidental business under Derek's name. And I'll be honest, we never paid for our products again after the first month because the results were so big for both of us and just naturally sharing, it, it took us to a different place. So we were able to pay for our products. Well, then we were getting to the point where I was like, I have this bill sitting in front of me and you know those bills that make you want to throw up? They just make you want to puke. So I was sitting there and it was a double bonus month for us. Um, and I mean, I'm not guaranteeing those are going to come out, but um, again, in this short period of time, but even without it, I still would have been able to pay my property taxes over the course of about six weeks. But within one month, I was able to earn $1,400 US. My first month of signing up myself, $1,400 US, okay? That was life-changing for me, and that's when my eyes were really open. Without the double bonuses, I still would have been close to 1,000 US, okay? That, it, no word of a lie, this happened. This is what made me go, huh, this actually helped to bridge that gap. It helped me pay something off that had been like nagging on me for so long and I was able to really catch the vision of what this business could do and it really only comes from naturally sharing from your heart. If I try to sell people something, I'm gonna tell you I fail every time. But when I tell people the truth, um, you know, and that's how that's how we started too. I, you're gonna hear from Alita Langford tonight. Um, I started because I heard her story of hope and you're gonna hear it. So if you're scared right now, honestly, don't be. You have this. You have the ability to be able to help with your immunity and your health and your mental health during this time. Um, and we can help you bridge that gap if that's what's something that you're looking for. There are tons of ways to make money online right now. This is probably the most inspiring and team focused way that you could. Um, so that's all I have to say, but I'm gonna let Derek hop on and talk. We're here together because we're all in this together, guys. Like this crazy time right now, the entire country is in this together. So we're sitting here together because it's a whole lot of togetherness and social isolation. So here he goes, here's Derek. Uh. She can't even escape me no, now. I this can't. is the best. Um, so I guess I have um, a couple branches of hope is is why I first started. Um, the first one was was Carmen and and her health. And for those of you who are fortunate to know her well, um, could see the way she sparkles and the way she lights up a room and 
and her personality is infectious. She paid me to say all this. I, I did. And, um, and, but we had some really dark times where I was like, man, like, I see all this in you. Like, but she, she couldn't see it in herself. And it actually started with sleeping. And the, the sleep started to, to help her waking up kind of like rested and energized and and being able to sleep without medication was one of in my opinion one of the biggest um transitions in in her well-being so my my one branch of hope was for Carmen and her health and um you guys could I think in this page you could actually go in and check out her her whole story but um, to see the 180 that she's done in life um, is nothing short of inspiring. And man, like, go and check her story out. Don't cry. Don't cry. We're on national TV. Yeah. We're international TV. Yeah. There we go. Um, and so I guess my, my second branch of, of hope, guys, is um, like Carmen said, we had... Uh, two houses two homes when we um when we first started this um so with that being said single dad three kids i was out of the house anywhere from 12 to 15 hours a day and um so i had a lot of single parent guilt to go with business owner guilt because it like the conflict was so great because i know i needed to spend time with my kids um, but I also needed to be built in a business to provide for the kids, but it was taking up all my time. And then the, the industry um, started taking a turn and I wasn't really sure if I could stomach the turn that had to be made to invest more time away from now the, the blended family and um, so for me, I was looking for something. And in our industry, we owned a gym. So we're personal trainers. And uh, as I'm sure most of you know, Carmen's a nutrition coach too. Um, but one of the hopes I had with, the, with um, this business was to bridge the gap during the slow times in the training season. So, you know, whether the economy took a turn and our income would fluctuate with, um, with the clients, um, continuing training or not, or whether people went away on vacation. So um, building this for us has really allowed us to bridge the gap. And then, you know, with the, the environment we're in today, we have clients counseling and we've just had to counsel clients for the next couple of weeks. So again, this, this business has allowed us to bridge the gap um, to fill in the income that we're now short from our from our training business. And I guess the, the biggest thing this has allowed us, instead of being in the gym 12 to 15 hours a day now, um, six days a week, is that it's allowed us to um, buy back some time in our lives and cut back our one-on-one -on -one training time. So we're home more with the kids. Um, this past hockey season, I've seen more of my children's hockey games than I have in the last six or seven years. So um, those were my two branches of hope guys was Carmen um, starting to feel good about herself and, and you know, live, live the, the way I like, live to the picture I had of her in my mind. And then the other was, was bridging the gap really um, financially from our traditional business um, during the slow times. Um, so we carry on doing uh, what we like to do and, and the kids were still able to be involved in the activities that, that they could do. So I've just been given the Oscar tap because now I'm talking too long and I've got the hook so I'm out. Thanks guys. Um, thank you so much guys for, for tuning in. Um, I hope you Oh, the doorbell's ringing. This is just what happens at our house. So um, I really appreciate you hopping on tonight. You're going to hear from Alita Langford tonight. And her story is really what got us started in this because she had such a story of hope. And when I was in that dark space, Derek's going to go answer the door. When I was in that dark space, um, when I heard her story, I thought if 
she can have hope, why can't I? So don't be scared, guys. Don't panic. We've all got this. We're in this together. If you need help with immunity, your health, your mental health, all that stuff, and bridging that gap, we're here to help. And we just want to serve you and get everybody to where they need to be. Have a great evening, guys. Thanks for tuning in.